As an IT partner working in the alternative investment space, one of the most common questions we get asked is what should we do about cybersecurity? In this business cybersecurity guide, I'll give you six tips that we see as the foundations of a good practice in this area. Tip number one is doing the basics well. Make sure that you're on top of asset management and patch management. You can't protect your assets properly if you don't know what you're trying to protect. And your efforts are equally wasted if you don't keep assets up to date with all security fixes. Start your assessment with a physical inventory of hardware, such as laptops, mobile phones. Then take an inventory of intangible assets, information assets, starting with your most important and sensitive data. Your strategy is then built around securing those assets. Tip number two, multi-factor authentication, or MFA. Everywhere, all of the time, across as many systems as possible. The process of requiring users to provide two or more steps of verification is your first line of defense against cyber criminals. Your goal should be to integrate every IT service within your organization into the same identity and access management solution protected by MFA. Tip number three, end user education and testing. If multi-factor authentication is your first line of defense, then your staff are the last line of defense. Educate your team on the threats and provide practical steps to help them secure your business. Test your team to recognize common attacks such as phishing and ensure that they fully understand what to look out for and encourage them to report it. Tip number four, robust email and endpoint security. As a minimum, you should invest in fit-for-purpose email and endpoint security solutions to protect your business. Email is still the most popular attack vector for cyber criminals, so implementing a sophisticated email security solution will massively help reduce the number of successful attacks that reach your team's mailbox. At the endpoint, we now recommend that clients use a Managed Detection and Response, or MDR, service that includes a next-generation endpoint security agent backed by a 24-7 security operations center to ensure that threats are found and quarantined as quickly as possible. This gives you peace of mind that your endpoints are as secure as possible regardless of where they are. Tip number five, backups and disaster recovery. Have separate air gap backups of all business critical data so that in the event of a breach, you're able to recover from it. Ensure that your disaster recovery plan is kept up to date and fit for purpose. Does it meet the needs of your organization? For example, if there was a problem, could you restore your systems quickly enough to minimize the impact on day-to-day -day business? And finally, tip number six, adopt the cyber incident response plan. But not only having a plan, you need to test it. Consider how often you scroll through the news and see a story of a data breach at a major company. If it can happen to them, it can happen to you. Business leaders need to adopt the mindset of when rather than if and work with their managed service provider to build a robust plan. At Tribeca, we're passionate about helping to protect our clients' businesses from the growing number of cybersecurity threats. We have a dedicated team of security professionals whose primary aim is to further enhance the security of our clients. In addition, we recently launched the Tribeca Trust Center on our website so that clients can have absolute confidence that we're maintaining the highest certified standards in information security including ISO 27001 and Cyber Essentials Plus. You can find out more on our website at tribeca-it.com.